welcome back. It's Lionel Tech Lead and partner at Westport. And today I'm coming to you from Perth, Western Australia. As you can see, beautiful sunset. It's about uh, six o'clock here in the evening. And uh, today I want to talk to you about uh, custom software versus off the shelf. Uh, something I just had a discussion with another tech lead here in Perth uh, about when you should use custom software or and when you should use off the shelf software uh, in your business. So um, there are some pros and cons uh, for both options. Custom software generally costs more money, um, it takes more time, it's more labor intensive. Off the shelf software, you can deploy it very quickly. You heard it Asana, Jira, Task Manager, uh, Monday.com, simple uh, to do list systems. The question is when should you choose to use uh, either the custom or the off the shelf? So I've got three uh, reasons. So the first uh, requirement is it is your business. That's, that solution is your business. For example, if your entire business is in the marketplace, then it makes sense to go custom for that. If it's not your business, so for example, if you have uh, got a business selling widgets and you want an HR software, you might want to consider something off the shelf. You might want to consider uh, the numerous payroll software that's out there. Um, why do you want to have customized? First is the competitive advantage. If you have custom software, right? Think of a custom shirt or anything like that. That even a small change, 1% difference will give you an enormous advantage against the competition, especially in tech. In tech, one difference, one page, one feature will give you that advantage. So it makes sense to invest in that. Second of all, you won't get a competitor with the same product that you have. So they will beat you if they have more money, they'll beat you if they have more funding. That is just the way uh, if you use off-the-shelf software. So that's the first reason. The second point is if you have a specific need, a very specific need that is not available off the shelf. So I'll give you an example with us, why we went with paperless task management system is because we have a ongoing set of developers actually coming into a project. So these people may or, not, uh, may or may not have that expertise in that area. I don't have a standing army or standing workforce of developers who can be brought up to speed with Jira and all the task management systems. So uh, our, um, what do you call, management level is much lower than uh, Silicon Valley company. And you'll see this uh, quite uh, frequently in a lot of tech companies outside Silicon Valley. So the onboarding has to be a lot easier we cannot have them uh, spending hours and hours learning Jira. We cannot. We have to have something very specific in there, very fast. So, usually in this case, it's either the bottom twenty percent or the top twenty percent. So, bottom twenty percent is you are dealing with people who uh, don't have time to learn such a system. They have to be onboarded very quickly, or you're dealing with the top twenty percent who have very very highly specialized needs that off the shelf cannot give you. So. One point about this is that off-the-shelf software is generally meant to serve the middle 50-60% of the market. So they're not really usually too concerned about the bottom 20%, either the you know, unique needs or the skill sets are not there, or the top 20% who have some funny requirement that you don't serve. So this is where you want to have your custom-made software. And um, during the task management system, I've seen countless number of times where we have uh, ran into an issue for uh, during the onboarding process uh, of uh, somebody with tech experience and we have just been able to say hey we love that feature we want to go out get that feature and install it in and we've been able to roll out that kind of thing within the first 30 days <clears throat> to West Vault uh, our task management system is our secret sauce that is how we manage uh, a team uh, in project management in um, <clears throat> being a tech lead Managing your team is critical. That is our secret sauce. So having our own in-house custom system gives us that advantage, both with dealing with the customers, because customers, you cannot say, force them to use uh, a task management system. You cannot onboard or train them. You have to have something that really works with them, works with their skill level. Remember, not everyone. The third reason is if you cannot find the quality off the shelf. 
So example is um, back in the day when we were doing accounting software, uh, we, there was no zero. Could not find a decent cloud provider of this software. So we, we searched high, we searched low. Uh, either they were too difficult, it required me to hire somebody with accounting background and would have jacked up the cost, or it just wasn't available. So at that point of time, say if you are uh, here in Perth and you, it's very hard to get off the shelf software, let me for the accounting environment down here, then getting custom software will give you that advantage and that flexibility. So those are three reasons when you're considering uh, whether you should hire somebody to customize your software or buy something off the shelf. So very interesting in this area. I hope you take that to mind and I'll see you next time because I'm the tech lead and that's the bottom line because the tech lead said so, All right?